Sparkling like a rainbow, diamonds are a girl's best friend. But did you know that diamonds are not only a symbol of love and commitment, but also a fascinating natural wonder that never ceases to amaze us? From the rarest hues to the biggest sizes, diamonds have a mesmerizing quality that has captivated humans for centuries. In fact, some of the most expensive diamonds in the world are so rare that they are considered one of a kind, with price tags that defy imagination. Diamonds aren't just beautiful and expensive, they also have a rich history and cultural significance. They've been owned by royalty and played a role in some of the most controversial events in history. Today, diamonds continue to fascinate and inspire designers to create luxurious and unique jewelry. Ready to discover the top 10 most expensive diamonds in the world and their incredible stories? Join us on a journey through the captivating world of diamonds and explore their timeless beauty and unmatched value. Welcome to Beyond Riches, the place where you get a glimpse into the secret lives of the ultra-wealthy beyond your richest dream. Counting down at number 10, the Heart of Eternity Diamond. Valued at a staggering $16 million, this is truly a rare gem. Discovered at the South African Premier Diamond Mine, the world's largest supplier of blue diamonds, this stunning stone is one of a kind. Have you ever wondered why blue diamonds are so elusive, with only one being found on average each year? The rough stone weighed 777 carats and was carefully crafted into a series of heart, pear drop, and oval-shaped diamonds, with the heart of eternity being the largest. The finished piece has been on tour at various exhibitions, including the Millennium Exhibition in London and the Smithsonian Museum. Boxing legend Floyd Mayweather sure knows how to pack a punch when it comes to engagement rings. In 2012, he reportedly purchased the Heart of Eternity diamond as a symbol of his eternal love for his fiancée. While the selling price was never revealed, it's safe to say that this stunning blue diamond is worth its weight in gold. With its estimated value of $16 million, the rarity and beauty of this gem make it truly priceless. If only all proposals could be this knockout. Number 9. Musayef Red Diamond What's red, rare, and worth a whopping $20 million? The Musayef Red Diamond with only up to 30 true red diamonds ever found, this 13.90 carat gem is a true marvel of nature. Discovered in Brazil in the 90s, it was bought by the William Goldberg Diamond Corporation and transformed into a stunning cranberry-colored 5.11 carat triangular brilliant cut diamond. Originally named by the Red Shield, it was later renamed by Mosaic Jewelers when they purchased it for $8 million at the turn of the century. This coveted diamond has been shown at various exhibitions, including the Smithsonian, and is estimated to be worth at least $20 million if sold. But let's be honest, can you really put a price on such a rare and breathtaking gem? At number 8, we have the perfect pink diamond. At a record-breaking $23 million, the perfect pink diamond was the most expensive jewel ever sold in Asia back in 2010, and it's not hard to see why. This rare gem weighs 14.23 carats and is graded as fancy intense pink. If you thought all diamonds were created equal, think again. Pink diamonds of over 10 carats are incredibly rare, with only 18 examples having been auctioned off in the past 244 years. The perfect pink's exceptional beauty and rarity made it a unique piece that sold for $10 million more than expected. If you take a look at the rose and white gold ring setting and rectangular-shaped diamonds on either side, it's clear that this gem is truly one of a kind. If you're on the hunt for a pink diamond of this caliber, be prepared to dig deep into your pockets. Number 7. The Wittelsbach Diamond What happens when a rare blue diamond with a royal history disappears for decades? Either the Wittelsbach diamond, a gem with a story as intriguing as its stunning blue color and impressive weight of 35.56 carats. Who originally owned it? How did it disappear for so long? And what led to its controversial recutting in 2008? These are just some of the questions that make this diamond a true enigma. 
dating back to the 17th century, it was sold to Louis XIV of France and passed down through royal families before being sold by the German government in the 1930s. For decades, rumors swirled about its whereabouts until it re-emerged in a Belgian jewelry store in 1962. Its $23.4 million sale in 2008 and controversial recutting only add to the mystery surrounding this gem. One thing's for sure, this Fiddlesbach diamond is a gem unlike any other. Number 6. The Oppenheimer Blue Diamond the Oppenheimer Blue Diamond is a real gem that made history back in 2016 when it sold for a jaw-dropping $57.5 million. And it's no wonder why. Weighing in at 14.62 carats, this is the largest fancy vivid blue diamond ever offered for sale. Named after its previous owner, Sir Philip Oppenheimer, this rare gem is set in a platinum ring with trapeze-shaped diamonds on either side, making it a real showstopper. Its color is so intense that it's been graded as fancy vivid, a rare term used to describe diamonds that are medium to dark in tone and strong in saturation. In fact, only 1% of blue diamonds are fancy vivid, making this gem is a real standout. It's enough to make you wonder who was lucky enough to wear this incredible diamond on their finger. Coming in at number 5, we have the Pink Star. Have you heard of the Pink Star Diamond that made headlines in 2017 when it sold for an astonishing $71.2 million? This rare gem is not only the most expensive diamond ever sold, but it's also the largest internally flawless fancy vivid pink diamond ever graded by the Gemological Institute of America. The story of this impressive diamond began when it was mined by De Beers in Africa in 1999. The original rough stone weighed a whopping 132.5 carats, but it took two years of careful planning, cutting, and polishing to transform it into its current oval shape, a process that shaved off over 70 carats. With its spectacular size and color, it's no wonder that the identity of the new owner is being kept a secret. But let's face it, with a diamond this big, it's going to be tough to keep it under wraps if they ever decide to wear it out. Number 4. Centenary Diamond Get ready to be dazzled by the Centenary Diamond, discovered in 1986 at the Beer's premier mine thanks to some cutting-edge X-ray technology. This sparkling beauty weighs a whopping 599 carats, making it the third largest diamond ever found at the mine. But what really sets it apart is its stunning modified heart-shaped design, which took a specialist team 154 days to hand cut. They even had to create a special underground room at Johannesburg to make sure the temperature and vibrations were just right and avoid any costly mistakes. With an impressive 247 facets, including 164 in its pavilion and crown and 83 on its girdle, this diamond is a true masterpiece, weighing in at 273.85 carats. Although it has been on display at the Tower London for years, the identity of its true owner remains a mystery. And since it has never been put up for sale in a public auction, the actual value of this breathtaking gem is hard to estimate. But one thing's for sure, when it was unveiled in 1991, it was insured for an incredible $100 million. At number 3, we have the Hope Diamond. The Hope Diamond, a jewel with a spooky backstory, is one of the most well-known rocks on the planet. It's huge, weighing in at 45.52 carats, and has a unique sky blue color that radiates a red glow. King Louis XIV of France bought it in 1668, and it disappeared during the French Revolution before resurfacing in London in 1812. After changing hands many times, it ended up in the possession of Evelyn Walsh MacLean, who had it put in a fancy setting surrounded by lots of other sparkly gems. The diamond is reputed to be cursed and has caused trouble for its owners over the years, with bad luck and tragedy befalling many of them. Nowadays, the Hope Diamond is on display at the Smithsonian Museum, where it has brought good fortune despite its reputation. Although it has never been sold publicly, it is estimated to be worth over $200 million and is insured for a cool $250 million. Now the question is, would you dare to own the infamous Hope Diamond despite its reputation for bringing bad luck? Number 2. 
the Cullinan. How would you like to own a diamond that weighs 3,106.75 carats and is twice the size of any other diamond ever found? The Cullinan diamonds, also known as the Star of Africa, all originate from one stone that was found at the premier mine in South Africa. Named after the owner of the mine, Sir Thomas Cullinan, the stone was later given to King Edward VII as a token of loyalty and attachment from the people of Transvaal to his throne and person. The Cullinan one, the largest, most valuable, and most prestigious of the diamonds, weighs 530.2 carats and has been cut into a pear shape. It's the one set in the head of the scepter with the cross of the British crown jewels and is removable for separate wear. Although it has never been publicly sold, the Cullinan one is thought to be worth over $400 million, with the entire Cullinan set valued at over $2 billion. Now that's what you call a true gemstone. And of course, our top pick on the list, the Kohinoor diamond. Have you ever heard of this diamond? This precious gem is worth over $1 billion, making it one of the most valuable diamonds in the world. But its value goes beyond its price tag. The Kohinoor diamond, part of the British crown jewels, has a fascinating and controversial history. Weighing 105.6 carats, it's known as the mountain of light and believed to be unlucky for men. Its ownership has been debated for centuries, with the first confirmed record of possession dating back in 1526 when Indian conqueror Babur had it. It changed hands between various Indian and Persian leaders until it was gifted to Queen Victoria in 1850. Indian authorities have demanded its return, claiming it was stolen from them during colonial times. But the British deny this, arguing it was a gift to the Queen. Despite the passage of time, the dispute over who has rightful ownership of this precious gem is still going strong. Maybe it's time for a reality TV show to settle this once and for all. I mean, who wouldn't want to see a diamond custody battle? Diamond prices can vary based on a range of factors, such as rarity and demand. The market also constantly sees new diamonds being introduced, which can fetch eye-watering prices from wealthy buyers. Moreover, each diamond has a unique and intriguing backstory, which is why these precious stones are considered the most highly valued gems in the world. Don't you find it fascinating how these gems hold such a lure and continue to be highly sought after? Let us know in the comments below. And if you want to stay updated on more content like this, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell. Until then, keep an eye out for our next video.